What is Eigen Decomposition Theorem? Do you know that to map impervious surfaces around the world, remote sensing is used? Remote sensing is the science of obtaining information about objects or areas from a distance, typically from an aircraft or a satellite. In multispectral remote sensing, huge dimensions of data are exchanged which normally would take minutes to be transferred. In order to reduce the dimensionality of data for fast transmittal, eigenvector decomposition is widely used these days. Let's dig into this interesting concept. Let A be a linear transformation represented by a matrix A. If there is a non-null vector x in the real plane such that a multiplied by x is equal to lambda x for some scalar lambda, then lambda is called the eigenvalue of a with corresponding eigenvector x. The decomposition of this square matrix A into eigenvalues and eigenvectors is known as eigen decomposition theorem. Letting A be a k cross k square matrix with eigenvalue lambda, then the corresponding eigenvectors satisfy, which is equivalent to the homogeneous system. So we can write A minus lambda i whole multiplied by vector x is equal to 0, where i is the identity matrix. Relating to Kramer's rule, a linear system of equation has non-trivial solutions. If the determinant vanishes or is equal to zero, so the solutions of the above equation are given by determinant of a minus lambda i equal to zero. Let's solve a question based on the above theorem. Question. If 6 into a inverse is equal to a square plus c a plus d i, where matrix a is as shown, then c comma d is? The options are. This question was asked in IIT JEE 2005. Solution. In the question, we are given a matrix a and 6 into a inverse is equal to a square plus c a plus d i. From the previous theory that we have just learned, we can see that the matrix is a square matrix. Writing the characteristic equation for this square matrix, we get determinant of a minus lambda i equal to 0. 1 minus lambda 0, 0, 0. 1 minus lambda 1, 0 minus 2, 4, minus lambda equal to 0. Simplifying this, we get lambda cube minus 6, lambda square plus 11, lambda minus 6 equal to 0. Replacing lambda with a, we can call this equation 1. Now coming back to the given equation and multiplying both sides by a, we get 6i equal to a cube plus c a square plus d a which can be simplified to a cube plus c a square plus d a minus 6i equal to 0. We can call this equation 2. On comparing equation 1 and 2, we get c equal to minus 6 and d equals to 11. Hence, the correct answer is option A. Please like, share and comment on the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more interesting and educational videos to earn while you learn. Download Extra Class app from Google Play Store and get rewarded for study.